Hi, this is Sheila with Qu Oh, wow, I almost said Quantum Playground first, and I was going to. Oh, that's interesting. So it is a Quantum Playground and a Conscious Conversation Central tonight, actually. I, I wanted to say that because this is actually BZ's idea, but we're kind of mixing it up in this fashion. It's not a campfire, but I'm excited for this. Maybe. So tell us what we're going to be doing, BZ, because I'm really excited about it. <laughs> We're um, as if we were all in the same room together physically and an, on an energetic envelope there. We're going to do um, uh, a quantum playing with self. So each individual self, all of ourselves, all in the energetic envelope. And then all um, from the all in the energetic envelope. And we're doing... Um, it's called noticing your DNA beaming. And so what we'll do is just have this little beginning here and then we'll listen to the audio recording. Um, and for those watching this, you will actually see the full version of that. And then, um, and then we'll um, share where we went, what we did, and what we experienced on the back end of it. And then also that center part will be pulled out in its own video, should one decide to play with it. Um, and also, what I hope is to use it as a, a, a thought or a jumping off point to create your own, um, in your own voice, so that you can do these kinds of quantum plays with yourself. Awesome. Well, I, I neglected to say that uh, today is Wednesday, October the 31st. So it's Halloween. So I wanted to, I wanted to make sure we got the date in there too. So awesome. All right. So we just get ready to go play in yep. the quantum playground. All right. Yep. Get comfy and off we'll go. Notice your DNA beaming, a guided, quantum, playful immersion of self. Take a deep breath and relax. Feel into your body. Let your feet rest flat on the ground or the floor and let all of your body relax. Just set aside what's come before. You can pick it up later. You can close your eyes or watch the visuals, whichever you prefer. Breathe in deeply and begin to feel the totality of you. All aspects, all cells, all fibers of the magnitude of who and what and all that you are. Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. And again, breathe in and out. Breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth. Let yourself be. Let yourself see. Let yourself feel. Let yourself immerse in yourself, of self, with self. Notice your DNA. Notice all of that which you are. Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. Let yourself feel. Let yourself see. Let yourself be in this playful immersion of 
self. You are a stargate. We are each a stargate. See the totality of you. See yourself as this stargate. See yourself connecting to all through from within the portal of you. Feel and see and experience the colors of the primary rays, the ruby ray. See the ruby ray. Feel the ruby ray. Hear the song of the ruby ray. Breathe deeply. See the orange ray. Feel the orange ray, the song, the colors, the light. Flow with the orange ray. See the yellow ray. Feel the yellow ray. Glide on the yellow ray. Play in the light of the yellow ray. See the emerald ray. Feel its sparkle and glisten. Hear its music. See and feel, be with and play in the emerald ray. See the sapphire ray. Play in the light of the sapphire. Hear its music, see its sparkle, hear its joyful, resounding vibrance. Breathe in the sapphire ray. See the indigo ray. Feel the indigo ray. Wrap yourself in the sound, in the music, in the song of the indigo ray. Feel the violet ray. Hear the music of the violet ray. See the hues, the textures, the expansion of the violet ray. Breathe in deeply through your nose and out through your mouth. Sit in this space of all of the rays. Sit with the space, the knowing, the sensing, the being and the completion in and of and with these primary rays. Breathe in deeply through your nose and out through your mouth. Notice your DNA beaming, broadcasting pure photonic light. Notice your connection to these rays, the ruby ray, the orange ray, the yellow ray, the emerald ray, the sapphire ray, the indigo ray, the violet ray. Notice your DNA beaming, broadcasting pure photonic light. Breathe in deeply through your nose and out through your mouth. Feel the light Hear the light. Hear the music of all of these rays throughout all of your being, all of your bodies, all of your presence. 
breathe in deeply. Immerse yourself deeply in self. Your multidimensional self is taking over the journey. Each being as they embody all that they are, the totality of their being, they firmly connect, integrate, and engage their multidimensional attributes and materialize them in tangible, noticeable, experienceable ways in your personal and collective realities. Feel the truth of this. Feel, to some, the newness of this. Feel the memory of this, the remembering of this, the reconnection of this, the realignment, recognition, and rejoicing of this. We are intertwined with the electromagnetic grids of Gaia as our DNA is linked and synced with these in the accelerated, amplified, and attuned expansion of the collective timeline and trajectory shift. Feel into this. Remember the knowing of this, the anticipation of this. The preparation for this and the joyful purpose, delicious anticipation of this. Remember your connection. Remember your being. Remember the totality of the immensity of self and all that you are. Step in now. Play with now the higher rays, the expanded rays, the arrays that hold all of the other primary rays, the crystal ray. Feel the crystal ray. See and play, slide and flow, and fly on the crystal ray. Breathe in deeply. Catch the golden ray. See and sense and feel the colors, the vibrancy, the harmonics. Remember the energy and the frequency of the golden ray as it suffuses throughout all of your being, pours into every molecule, every fiber, every frequency thread of that which you are. Fly on the golden ray. Soar on the golden ray. Breathe in deeply. Immerse yourself in the flow and the frequency of the platinum ray. Hear the music of this ray. See it sink and flow and amplify all that you are. Glide on the platinum ray as you flow, as you see, as you embrace, as you remember the truth of who you are. The diamond ray is here now, engulfing you, enveloping you, immersing you in the totality of who you are. Your multidimensional self is taking over the journey and you are joyfully joining, embracing, playing and delighting in that. As you, the truth of who you are, flows with that. Excited anticipation and joyful moving forward with that. The diamond ray is the infinite undifferentiated light, the pure, clear light of source, 
the pure white light of the Alpha and the Omega. It is that which you are. You remember that which you are. You embrace that which you are. Breathe in deeply through your nose and out through your mouth. See all of the rays. Feel and hear and rejoice in the beauty, the brilliance, and the sparkling light of all of the rays. They are all within you. They are all you. And you are immersed in all of them. Immerse yourself in the pure love light and light love infusion flowing in the crystalline, Christed, rainbow frequencies bathing the planet, the cosmos, carried upon the celestial currents and the transformational waves that penetrate all in the all. Our DNA is now beaming broadcasting pure photonic light. Be aware, cognizant, mindful of your expanded consciousness with word, will, and walking of your path. Remember, remember who you are. Remember the beauty of who you are. Remember the all-encompassing love that you are. So let yourself come back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can hardly see. <laughs> okay, that was fun. I need more time with that. <laughs> Yeah, a lot more time. Like uh, the lower half of me still hasn't like. I can't. Uh, no, my. Okay. <laughs> I said that like that. Okay. I feel like my feet are stuck to the floor. I'm. I'm not kidding you. It's. It's, it's uncanny because there's so much uh, energy running. <laughs> yeah. It's almost like it's fused to the floor. <laughs> yeah, that was fun. That was very nice. Yeah. Awesome, BZ. It's interesting. I couldn't really see anything in the beginning. Oh. And at the, I couldn't see anything in the beginning. It was really, really dark. And the more I tried to see something, the darker it got. And then, and then I realized, oh my God, my body's filling up <laughs> in a really uh, unique way. Like I filled the whole kitchen. Like I could almost feel the walls and the ceiling against me. It was a density. I don't know. It was a very, very unique feeling. One I've never experienced in quite that fashion before. And then it, then it started to move. Um, and it was, first I was sensing it, you know, sort of the up and out and the, and the coming back uh, under, you know, through my feet. Uh, and then there was a, a spin to it that came and it felt like, um, well, it's part of my connecting with the earth, so I could feel the earth coming up through a particular spin that was a core. 
Well, after a while, I could see color, really bright color. It was uh, a, a line, first just a straight line of color, and it was a um, Tiffany blue, really bright. I've never seen that color before. And it was um, shooting kind of bullety like energy because it was like one would form and then leave. So it did that a couple of times. And then that started to incorporate in the spin and the go round fun. Um, <laughs> I don't even know. There was a lot taking place in there that I am I I can't even I can I don't have words for. <laughs> and I'm feeling very full. <laughs> I don't know. I'm gonna be quiet now. <laughs> Sorry. You seem a bit giddy, I would say, as well. When yeah. you describe the <clears throat> filling up, were were you were you in the in the vessel in the shirt filling up or were you filling up the room and it the walls are right there because you weren't just the little vessel in the shirt, you were yeah. uh, yeah, but all of me filled the room because I could feel the walls. You know what I mean? It was very, very full. And I still feel, and it's a bit heavy. There's a density to it. It's full is what I want to say. And I feel like really full too. <laughs> it's a fullness. And it's not a bad full, It's but it's very, very full. And... A little anxiety provoking. <laughs> like my body doesn't want to breathe properly or it. That's funny. Huh? Uh, yeah. That's so there's that. <laughs> that came with it. So it was very visceral for me, kind of surprising. I was hoping for more visual and I was really trying for visual. <laughs> <laughs> and that's not really what happened. But at the end, I did. That's why I say I think if I spent more time with it, maybe I could. Um, I felt like there's a thing that was happening, that a cohesive flow that I think if I spent more time with would be a good call. Yeah. I think it's very interesting because I too... Started. Do you feel it? Do you still feel sort of, have you got anything going on, Sheila, for you? Well, yes, I have. I, like I said, there's a, it's, it, it feels like a circuit of energy. And I, I'm, I'm, but I've been practicing that with myself, that circuit of energy that I have been feeling um, within me. Um, just practicing the noticing and the feeling of it, but this seemed a bit more intense and um, <clears throat> possibly because I haven't been practicing it over the last several days mm -hmm. is part of that. And, but I found it very interesting that the one really good visual I got because I had the same thing. I wasn't really having a lot of visual. I saw some uh, color, but it wasn't what I expected, meaning that uh, I experienced color, but not like in sequence of what you were, you know, stating. Okay. And it wasn't all of those colors either, but, but when you mentioned the Tiffany blue shooting out part, mm -hmm. uh, m mine would have been, I would have called it like a Tiffany blue, only more electric sort of Tiffany blue. Yeah. Cause it was light. And yes. And, and it felt faceted to me when I saw it and, um, and I only saw it briefly, like one or two, almost like jeweled. Uh, Sparkle. Yeah, that yeah. shot it. And then that was it. Yeah. yeah. 
Now, I did not have that. I found that quite interesting too. But of course, you know, you you are used to your energy being quite expansive. So I found it very interesting that you felt yourself being. Yeah, you haven't done that in a long time. That's interesting because yeah. that's very specific. It's outside of your body, and yet you felt yourself because you said like the walls. You're, were you speaking the walls inside your body or the walls in the kitchen? Because I was, I was picturing you expanding your energy outside of your body, but yet crammed up against the ceiling in the kitchen. I don't know why, but I did. So yeah, it just felt like I felt the room. <laughs> felt the room. Okay, so yeah, I, I my visual that I got from that would be right then. I didn't. I did not have that uh, that particular experience at all. But but uh, yeah, still almost don't. My feet don't feel quite fused to the floor any longer. However, yeah, I'm feeling more normal now. <laughs> yeah, I, I I would like to say, however, that I the first thought when I felt into okay, I feel like I'm part of the floor. Well, the first thing I got is well, you are all. So, I. I, I I find that quite interesting because that would, you know. Melded with the floor. <laughs> Why not? That's quite interesting. I mean, it's not that I didn't, you know, because I've been, I've known for quite some time now. I feel strongly that, you know, all is, means all. It means everything. Well, and, so and that's part really of what interesting. You, what you were both describing is um, I didn't, it's something that uh, it's new to me uh, actually in the process of, of putting this all together. So yeah. uh, following the instructions and then the inspiration, everything unfolded. And that's the black ray, which is the void space, Yeah. which is uh, the way it came to me. It's the bundle of all of the colors of the ray, which come to yeah, me. I felt like the entire time when you describe that, that's because it was all there and it was very dark, it wasn't visual. But I did at the end get those little bullets of light that started to shoot up. That was so exciting. <laughs> okay, hold, hold up a second. Did you, did you, so, oh, wow, I must have went somewhere. It matches the void space that so many beings have been in in the last well, it's different for everybody, but could be anywhere from the last 10 days to two days, you know, where depending on each being and where they are, as we're just about to make this next, it's a, it's a, it's a trajectory shift. It's a timeline, although that's in my sensing is not quite accurate. It's much bigger than that. It's a, it's a trajectory shift. Um, yeah. for uh, the collective. Okay, well, I'm just, it's just that I'm noticing something very specific here all of a sudden. What? I didn't hear BZ say anything about a black ray. I didn't. I just oh. said, oh. Oh, okay. I was like, wait a minute. Where did I go? I thought I heard the whole thing. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, okay. but there is a black ray. There's that's real. Right, right. Yeah. No, I feel that. I, I yeah. Feel that. <laughs> well, if you'd asked well, me that at seven o'clock this morning, I, I would have felt into it, but I wouldn't have had the same knowing that I have of it now. Right. Wow. Well, I'm, I'm a, Beckon to ask, yeah. would, would the black ray be also be akin to uh, ether, which is has been reported by loads of folks to carry the energy, the inner, the, the black color of black? I don't know. I'm asking what your thoughts and feelings are on that. Well, my my feeling of it is is that it's um, it's all of it, and it it wraps 
all of it combined and because it's all well what i was seeing was it's the braid of all of the colors but um the way that i understand it so i hold it that way now after experiencing what 15 minutes of that is in the past so so like prior to i don't know 40 minutes ago <laughs> i could have rode on the different rays and felt them and experienced them seeing right. them all that in all the different shades okay as they were all together right there was not the singularity of them, but oh. the unity of all of them. Oh, yes. I feel you. Yes. And that wrapped in the void so that breath of space between the unity and the singularity that we each are, you see or perceive the... the the no thingness or the the black voidness like a you know quote unquote a black hole you know right. it's black and whole and for a long time although not not for a while now but a long time before that it was nothing it was just this big hole that you went into and sucked everything up sucked all the light up because there was nothing in there and you know nasim and Harame and all sorts of others, I think beginning back with Planck in the 40s, discovered, no, no, that's not actually the case because inside the black holes are, you know, in one little tiny parsec, there are, it is galaxies worth in that. So that kind of would be how I would interpret that. Right. The other thing I, I thought was interesting was um, this was the first time that I experienced this guided playing even though i created it yeah i was so i was not right. to create this and <sighs> created it and then uh -huh. took the audio and sent you the audio which would be different than what actually goes out when people see all this. right and in that there were a lot of things that arrived suffice to say it as technical interruptions that I tested to proof because I was getting a little linear and annoyed and my New Yorker was coming out. So I was taking the same exact pieces of software and doing the exact same things yet not with this material and they were working just fine. And I would go to this material and the things would arise. So anyway, so what, one of the things I felt in this whole, so listening to it for the very first time, part of me was breathing and being there and being present and playing, although, you know, I had some residual, um, annoyances that were dancing and playing a bit and I know I'm not sure exactly when but I think it's in the first I don't know maybe five or six minutes where mm -hmm. it says um what was the line your multi-dimensional self is taking over the journey and instantaneously in my body, everything changed. It was like, right, step aside, <laughs> annoyed one. <laughs> I'm annoyed. <laughs> we, we got this now. Okay. I'm on board and right. So, um, to me, it was fascinating. I, I chuckled, and it was it was completely different. And all of me joined all of me and. Um, well, <clears throat> I, I don't know if it will be, uh, 
able if 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 folks can pick it out but i think i could because there was a there was in my view a very perceptible change in your voice so that was interesting yeah. to know that interesting cool wow well I'm I'm anxious to to hear this one again. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. And I do love the idea of recording one for myself too. Yeah. That's that is good. Yes. So I'm beckoned to ask might one oh I don't know get a transcript BC. Might um, that be available? <laughs> yeah, except the transcript. <laughs> That's the transcript, and then all the stuff that flowed in between came from that. Yeah. Ah, I see. So it would have to be uh, actually described first. <laughs> yeah, you'd have to transcribe. Well, it looks like it <laughs> work cut out for me. Oh, I see what you're saying. So they, so you could record. Well, yeah. Um, there's a thought, but no, I, I. Um, because well I, here's what i'm going to do i'm going to go when, whenever you put it out i will go ahead and transcribe it for myself and then i will go back and put it in uh well yeah because you're going to give me a copy too yeah. so i'll just put it in my in 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 the show more section of the video cool once once i've got it transcribed yeah, and give it to me and I'll do the same. Because I want to do it for myself, so I will do it for everyone else too. Yeah. I'd love to give you a transcript, but I haven't figured out how to. <laughs> no worries. No worries. That's coming. If I have anything to do with it, that's coming. Hey, if my feet can fuse to the floor, watch out. <laughs> well, the other thing too is that. Um, that that there is the grounding with Gaia and and the fusing is actually the the feeling and connecting of the totality of her and then the higher rays the more expanded rays are um, are in attunement with our uh, upper chakras so eight nine ten which are the um, another way to say that is that that our dna uh codes are um linked into and that is our uh, fluent connection and i say it that way because it's on all levels our fluent connection with gaia so what I get right now is that this is a combination of the grounding of the planet in kind of the, uh, the old energy processes and then the connecting of, of with Guy in her expanded self and our expanded self. I get the sense it's that kind of the, you know, as we, as we, in this trajectory shift, we're lifting off of one and flowing into the next. Well, that's, yes. Besides being fused to the floor, my, my, I was very floaty. That was my, my real big thing for the most part. While, while I had some of the, the you know th that action it was not as much as i have had in the past mine was more of a floaty just yeah it was very yeah, floaty. at the end it was that yeah. very very floaty mm -hmm. so yeah. my, i thought it I, was uh, great it was good. <laughs> my thought of being fused was a was a good thing so i wasn't <laughs> Flying up. Actually, that's that 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 crossed my mind. All right. <laughs> got it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, because there have been times when I just thought, you know, there was gonna I was gonna bore a hole through something because of the 
No. <laughs> Cool. So yeah, if you wow. wanna if you wanna transcribe it, that'd be great. And and people can make their own on this or any other. Um, it's always good. I mean, guided is nice because um, you can hit a button and it goes. But um, mm. it lets you do your own pacing and your own yeah focusing and, and mm. what you're nudged to do, what you're moved to do. Yeah. You know, I was nudged to do this for me, but I was also nudged to do this as this would be, um, because I have a, I have a an ongoing conversation with me about um, not feeling completely in sync with doing a lot of guided journeys for the very reasons that I just gave. Mm -hmm. because I, I, I personally, me and the shirt, feels it's better for each to do it ourselves. Yeah. Um, well, I, 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 have, I have had the desire, I think I might have said this off camera, I've had the desire to do that, and I haven't done it. I think there are beings who know why, I haven't figured it out yet, but I, I'm going, I, I, I want to do this. I, I, and since I'm motivated to transcribe this one in particular, I'm going to do my, cool. This time. Yeah. So thank you for this. Wow. Mm -hmm. This has been awesome. Yeah. Love this assignment. Different. I would love a different like nudge to, to play with <laughs> yeah that was great yeah no i love it and I, I would love to hear what any what others are experiencing because when this goes out you're going to have it uh because bz knows how to edit <laughs> so you're going to have it it's going to be really really cool so the audio will be nice and and everyone can hear it um uh, for themselves if they'd like and and I think you're also, and we'll make sure that a link to just the meditation, the guided meditation portion will also be linked in the show more section of the video once BZ has that done too. And then once I get the transcript, now if you go to the video and the transcript's not there, that just means that Sheila hasn't completed it yet. <laughs> As soon as it's completed, I will put it in there and save it. And as and as long as it takes YouTube to up, then it will be there. But so yeah, nice. All right. And then you Yay. might consider sharing yours when you record yours. Ooh. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can do that. I will do that. That's that's a good idea. Of course. Uh, oh. Okay. Yes. Thank you. I just, uh, I was getting ready. I was getting ready to say something and I got something else instead. I was going to say, of course I can't edit, but I think I might've found a way to do something where it would be just my voice and uh, pictures, but I don't have to edit. It's just a one shot deal. So I'm, I'll try that for this. That's awesome. Thank you, BZ. Cool. Yeah, well, that was the, the team that said, lay the challenge down for her. Ah, oh, okay, well. Let's see if she'll play with it. Thank, thank, thank the team, because, yes. <laughs> well, obviously, because it came, it came in like that, and uh, so now I have no more excuses either. <laughs> All right, well, cool. <laughs> <laughs> so Sheila just orchestrated a, are you falling in your nudges, nudges? Addendum to yeah, yeah. Yes, you know, right. play. <laughs> yes, yes, because apparently I have to be called on the carpet in public before I follow my <laughs> nudges. So if you're sitting out there wondering why you're not following yours, are you putting yourself on the carpet anywhere? <laughs> <laughs> it, it is really fun is, to follow on the I mean, you know. And it's October 31st, it so we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I, I really am going to do this because I actually, uh, now, that, now that the challenge has been down, 
I actually, I've, I've had a couple of creative things come in about this in particular. So thank you for that. Cool. Yay. <laughs> All right. Well, um, I would love to hear from others, though, about what they have experienced. So either too busy at the quantum playground, because that's, you know, I, and all, all of her, all of everybody's information is always in, in the show more section of the video. And, you know, there's comments too, both on uh, Conscious Conversation Central and over on BZ's channel. So feel free to leave them anywhere you'd like and or reach out to us individually or personally. So otherwise all the other usual things will be in all the usual places. <laughs> Was there anything else that either one of you wanted to add to this one? No, just thank you. <laughs> Have a nice time. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Thanks BZ. This okay. was awesome. Okay. Till next time. Till next time. Mm -hmm. Much love.